Alrighty, boys and girls. Let's take this from the top. I'm gonna play. I ought to do something about that first Drax. I don't like that first Drax. I think that first Drax is actually just a fine Drax. It's just that's not the Drax I've been using. I think it uses the many worlds theory, you know, which is every time you make a decision, the universe splits, and that's on the micro or the macro, you know. So every time a particle in the universe has a choice to split and go to the left or to the right, the universe becomes two. One of those particles goes to the left, one of those particles goes to the right. The same on the macro. Every time a person or something has a choice to make a decision, am I going to make a turn? Am I not? You go, no, oh, bet my face. Oh my gosh, I say that all the time to my kids, too. I'm gonna bite your face. Let's see how I'm gonna do. Oh, exposed, of course, of course. Because that's all they ever do to me. I'll never be able to just break that. He says, breaking that. Oh, let's see. That was him. <laughs> I wasn't immediately sure of the scream of agony just went, uh oh, those at me. But that was in the Lost Woods, wasn't it? Up to 10th level. And as you can see, I'm 9th level. As you can also see, there's been another patch. He's good enough that when these patches come out, they don't need to, uh, restart a whole game it repatches into thank you the actual game itself so you can just keep going with the same characters and it pops in all the I can't believe you mugwumps there's this no way to keep out of an exposed state <laughs> I like that. 900 points of damage. That is good. Oh, goody. Oh, yay. Oh, normally that would be such a nice saber, too. Let's bust it up and see what I get. A piece of wood. They've always turned into wood these days. I don't know why. Back out to the Lost Woods. I just discovered from that last time when I went out there and caught myself killed that maybe I shouldn't be rushing into areas. So I'm trying to do just a, a touch more grinding so that I don't get my uh, body torn apart into these small uh, tiny pieces that uh, it has been happening. Look at that! Exposed, slowed, wounded, bleeding. And you noticed I just ignored all that because if I was going to take care of those, I would have been all day and I wouldn't, I'd still be fighting him. Ah. And it's a piece of wood. No, but it is a, a nice piece of armor that, uh, I don't, oh. I like the pluses to my vitality. I'm equipping. And busting up the old one, which turns into a hide. Yay! Okay, I'm still just ninth, though. Man. Out to... Ain't gonna grind in the West Haven Fields. That's pointless. With its mouth open. Oh, that's better to prove oneself a fool than to open one's rear orifice. You know, that's probably very true. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. That's all. I went from 900 and some odd to that many hit points. Huh. Uh, still needs to go into my decks, though. Because I suck at my decks. And I'm using the crossbow still, so 
you know, I'm not always going to use a crossbow, so I'm going to bring up my something or other. Oh, shield you and your loved ones. Does that include mercenaries? I don't think I'd actually call mercenaries a loved one. Unless, well, let's just go check and see if John Nicklew's still in blacksmith. Oh no, it's Iono and Aloysius. Gosh, she had something going on with that Johnny Clue too. Man, now not only are her days lonely, but so are her nights and her bed. So sad. I'm gonna head to the rusted gates. Whoa. Or not. Huh. <laughs> with your enormous pecs, huh? Well, well, well. <sighs> well, I guess I better go to the Coliseum then. Oh, well, why did that happen? I better go to the Coliseum. Portals and soul shards, huh? Well, you know, I don't know if I have a, a key for the arena. Amber Violet is resting. Healthy, much more. Oh, goody. God, it's like 5,000 hit points. Oh, 2,490. So I better start with off with a feral ash. <laughs> Poor Amber Violet. <laughs> oh, but I got a soul shard! Yay! That was nice. Uh, no more silver keys, but I do have a questing keystone? Procedural dungeons? You know, I do want to spend time in the procedural dungeons, but first I want to see if I can leave without having to do that. Which is a monastery. Huh, the Lost Woods became the monastery? Or the Rusty Gate, I guess it was. Still, I'm going to try the monastery. Yep. Oh, maybe I should have gone back to the arena. Oh, man. <laughs> Preparing to charge. Well, being ensnared is better than, uh, <laughs> is better than being killed. Wow, that was a lot of experience off that crew. Oh, goody, yes, I'll trade that in, because I like the new defense. Scrap metal. Okay, well, I'm gonna grind a little bit more. Oh, it's another Lurg. But this one has potato face. Preparing to charge, but not charging. Now it's charging. Dodged. Justice. Final blast. You know, I am... Wow. That is... This is just mega experience I'm getting in this arena. I like it. I'm gonna punch this all into deck still, until that comes up to... At least as high as me wisdom. Then I'll go from there. Uh, since I'm pretty much basic, I'm gonna go back to five for the long, the long crossbow. <laughs> A little bit more grinding. Oh my God, Lissa's beer is dwarf urine. Good thing I took over. Tackled. You know what? I got something for your tackle. Holy smokes on a stick. Oh, okay. Uh, preparing to charge. Reposition. And, uh, smite flurry. Divine heal. A divine heal. Bash. Smite. Divine. Reposition. You jerk. Okay. It's the charge, miss, and the charge again that I thought was just weasel-like. 
Uh, you know, I sort of want to do that portal thing. Not the portal, the key storm. Key. I want to do the car storm. <coughs> hey, apologies. I'm coming down with a nasty, nasty, nasty cold. Uh, I'm going to go back out and just grind for it. Hoth! It's caressing a whiz orb. I played whiz orb. Oh, Bubba! Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's what I think, Loth. A hoth. At least it's not the hoth. Then I did kill, liquefy, and drink. The host. All right, four stat points. Okay, if I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna match my wisdom and then bring up both. All right, now with them up that high, that's not bad. I can start worrying about other things now to make sure that I don't just focus on one weapon and then lose it and end up as a knucklehead on ice. Oh yay, another mercenary. Now, sharp eyes, does that mean just number one is just working for me because he's green? And if I highlight him again, oh this time it does happen. Does this mean he's working with me and he's... Oh, you can only have one merc at a time? Can you really? Well, I mean, if that's true, then yeah, I'm going to keep... I'm going to grab Anthus, and I'm going to dismiss the others. Because I like his 15 damage, and I couldn't figure out a way to make them all work. Oh, let's see, what do you have? Oh my god! Yes! No! You bastard! Current gold? No, you're not a bastard at all. I'm buying that. Damn straight. I got all this from my last one. It's a dagger. Looks like a... Looks like a battle staff. View item? That's a nice item, but you can just eat it. Three... Yeah, you can eat that one, too. Yeah, you will, won't you? You're, it's like you're, you know, you're a blacksmith. You don't need me to validate your existence. Yeah, I bet there's other people that will buy things. That's another host. Oh, it needs numbing. Oh, goody. Well, I don't know what numbing does. <laughs> I don't I think it matters what, uh, what Knowing does at this moment. He's been vaporized. It just this nice pink mist that drifted across my face, leaving me going, oh my god. Okay. Oh, Ranger's good at dodging. Well. Ooh. <laughs> and then I murdered him. I just snuck up and murdered him. Oh my gosh. Oh. <sighs> the curse is one that I can't just go, oh, I'm going to ignore you. Oh, good. Wow, that was a good critical. That's because of that noise dagger I got. Cellar door? Oh, man, I'm almost afraid to. Saving my game isn't going to help. <laughs> <coughs> Not these times of permadeath, so I'm going to check out that cellar door. After fighting way through the monastery, you kick in the basement door. You nearly vomit as the stench of decomposing flesh assaults your nostrils. A large semi hominid humanoid creature with the head of a bowfine suddenly jolts up. He puts down the human leg he's been snacking on and looks up with you with a cold, vacant stare. Flesh meat. The Reaper snorts and readies his enormous beast of a maul. You stand your ground to prepare for battle. I don't know exactly how smart of an idea that is. Oh man, look at all that. This 
is not going to be pretty or fun, I have the feeling. Yeah, another day, another battle. Well, I might as well lead up with that. I ain't gonna kill him, I'm not even thinking about that. But I'm trying to bring him down. Ah! Uh. Oh! <sighs> Pisoned. Still poisoned. No more. And no more healing either. Reposition. Oh! Charged in. Not for an incredible amount. I think the biggest thing I got on this guy is the fact that I can heal and hopefully he can't. Oh, spewing toxic blood. That's awful. I can't believe you're doing this to me. God, it's a... Oh, no! Oh, for the love of God. Well, as we can see this time, the desire to win against the Reaper does not equal the ability to win against the Reaper. Keep this in mind while you're playing yourself. Desire never equals ability. So I've been slaughtered like a bug. I'm a little more than 15 minutes into this. Um, I'm going to call this one a day. <laughs> uh, but then I'm also going to, I think, put up a second one today where I'm going to uh, bust up these guys and teach them what for. This, this is just too ignominious a defeat. Well, thank you everyone. If you liked what you've seen, if you've liked what you've heard, please give me a like. Uh, if you subscribe, that'd be awesome. I love subscribers and I love every one of you. Uh, please a comment. Please a comment. Please leave a comment uh, below. I will read every one of them and answer them if possible. That's awesome. I love comments. Uh, so there, I will see you all probably next video. Yeah, hopefully my cold will be over.